I think all electric cars today are compromises. Uh, we have to develop the electric car. It needs to evolve. We need to know that we're on the right course. I mean, maybe it's a fuel cell which will take the place of the electric motor. At this point, it's very early days to know whether this is a definitive answer. Sir Michael Kaduri's Peninsula Hotel in Hong Kong boasts a fleet of 14 bespoke phantoms. His family business, China Light and Power, is one of Southeast Asia's leading power suppliers. The family's main business is electricity generation. And over the past 40 years, we've been trying electric vehicles from Bedfords in England in the 60s on to some of the more modern cars today, including the Mini. I think any responsible manufacturer of motor cars must consider uh, electric vehicles and hybrids. I think until the question of the life of the battery is solved, we won't really have a marketable vehicle. And it may well be that there's another form of power, clean power, which comes to the front in the long run. I think another area which should be looked at is extending the range of the petrol or diesel internal combustion engine. I think that has a lot of merit. If you had, say, 100 miles to the gallon with a car the size of the rails, that I think would, in fact, create a bigger impression than an electric car. The Phantom has presence. It has little details which you don't necessarily see in other cars. And this is very compatible with the peninsula thinking. You've asked me how an electric powered car would fit into the peninsula fleet. The answer, I think, is that it could fit in very well, providing it compared with the present car's performance and compared with the present amount of space available in the present car. It would, in fact, be another plus for green energy, and we work towards that in the hotel all the time. Like so many things, the technology today is not mature, and we are going to have to watch as it evolves and wait until it can deliver what we expect of a Rolls-Royce today. That's when the peninsula might consider electric Rolls-Royces. <laughs>